Hello, hello. Today I bring you big words. This book is written by Jamie Lee Curtis, who is an actress actually, and Laura Cornell. Little big words for big people. I actually said that title totally wrong. Let me try that again. Big words for little people. I know some big words. I'll teach them to you. Although you are small, you can use big words too. Big words aren't scary. They're big fun to learn. I was taught once. And now it's your turn. If you need some time to just be alone for doing weird dancing, to sit still as a stone, if someone is there and you need to pee, then say louder, loud and clear, hey, I need privacy. When mommy can't fasten the brand new car seat and the twins don't like what they got to eat, this is impossible. Mom says to us, please, we can't leave for school till you help me find my keys. Hmm. If you answer right when you spell a big word, your teacher might shout, stupendous, superb. And then you can celebrate, laugh, and have fun because you've worked really hard to get the job done. When you're at school and you get into trouble for chewing your gum and then exploding a bubble, and you stay inside when your friends get to play, your consequence is no recess that day. Ooh, that's a big word. When dad takes us shopping to buy new shoes, and all of us shout, this one I choose. And the salesman looks angry. He's pretty irate. Dad wants us to behave and to cooperate. That's a big word too. When something is perfectly right for your age, like TV and music, toys, all the rage. When a G-rated movie's the one that you seek, appropriate is the word mom will speak. Oh, that's a good movie too. Not this one. But many things are too old for you and that lots of your friends may still get to do. Inappropriate is the word your mom picks if you want to watch PG-13 when you're only six. Now this also applies to things online. You have to make sure you watch appropriate things for your age and inappropriate things are just not okay yet. When you wait and you wait for your chance at a turn and your feet are both hot and are starting to burn and there's still a long way to the front of the line, patience is the word you must try to find. It's one of my favorite words, patience. Mixing stuff up from the kitchen to drink that looks really gross and has a big stink is, as our green snotted brother's nose starts to get picked, disgusting, you'd cry. It means yucky and ick. So gross. To understand means you know when we say a street is for cars, it's not safe to play. You understand cows make milk and not juice. That you don't run on duck, but you do run on goose. Oh yeah. Inconsiderate is the word dad would pick if you woke up mom when she's feeling sick. But if you brought her a flower and tea, a considerate person is what he would see. I'm responsible, you say, when you pick up your toys and walk our dog Leo and try not to make noise. Responsible people try not to forget to water mom's bonsai or the table to set. Persevere is to try and to try, even though you might want to give up and cry. When doing a puzzle that puzzles your mind, you persevere to the right piece you find. Different means nobody's ever the same. All bodies are different, and so are our brains. Different is what makes this world so great. Different is never something to hate. 
but not all big words are as long as the rest. There are three, those short, that I love the best. Family is where we all belong, keeping us safe, making us strong. Family is yours, no matter whatever. We care about you forever and ever. Respect is the way we all treat each other. Mother to father, father to mother, brother to sister, sister to brother, and brother and sister and sister and brother. Love is the biggest big word of all. Four little letters that help you walk tall. Love is your family, your siblings, your friends. Love is your ocean without any end. See? Big words are easy. How well you've done. Now go off and have some really great fun. And next time a grown-up thinks you don't have sense, show them with big words your intelligence. The end. That was a good one.